Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're going to learn about systems of two equations, and we're going to solve each system by elimination. So, if I was given this system, 8x minus 6y equals a negative 20, and negative 16x plus 7y equals 30. When solving with an elimination, what I want to try to do is see if I can maybe add or subtract um, the top and bottom equation to eliminate essentially one of the variables. And so I'm kind of looking for opposites in a sense here. And I see 8x and negative 16x. And I, see, I know that if I multiply 8x by 2, I'd get a positive 16x. And I could add that to negative 16x, and that becomes 0. That's the ultimate goal there. So. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take this first top equation and I'm going to multiply the whole thing by 2. The whole thing by 2. So I'm going to put a little segue here. Transition over. So I'll multiply that whole thing by 2. So that becomes, well, 2 times 8x is 16x. And 2 times a minus 6y is a uh, minus 12y. And don't forget the negative 20. 2 times negative 20 is negative 40. If I did this right, I should just be able to transfer the second equation, negative 16x plus 7y equals 30. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to add them. Add these two equations straight up and down, okay? <clears throat> 16x and a negative 16x, when I add them together, is a zero. Fantastic. That's what I want. Negative 12y and a positive 7y is a negative 5. And negative 40 and positive 30 is a negative 10. So at this point, I have an equation with just one variable. So um, we just need to solve for that variable. Zero, don't really care about it. It's gone. I'm going to divide both sides by negative 5. This gets me y by itself. Negative 10 divided by negative 5 is a positive 2. So we have y to be a positive 2. So now what we're going to do is plug that back into one of my equations and simplify. I'm going to pick the first one again. The first one. So I'm going to take that 8x. All right, without the multiply by 2. So the 8x minus 6y equals negative 20. And I'm going to take this y being 2 and plug it in. So I have 8x. I'll plug it in for y. 8x minus 6 times 2 equals negative 20. 6 times 2 is 12. 8x minus 12 here equals negative 20. Add a 12 to both sides. We have 8x equals negative 20 plus 12, which is a negative 8. Divide by 8 to both sides. And x equals good old negative 8 divided by 8 is a negative 1. So we have our x and y value. We can combine them together to be a coordinate point, which is negative 1, comma. And there we have it, the final answer. So let's recap. We're given our two equations, 8x minus 6y equals negative 20, and negative 6x plus 7y equals 30. And what I want to do is solve this by elimination. Well, I multiplied the top equation by 2 of the whole thing, which gave me 16x minus 12y equals a negative 40. What that allowed me to do is eliminate the x variable, the x variable when I add them. When I add them, that happened. Then negative 12y and 7y became a negative 5y, and negative, uh, negative 40 and 30 become a negative 10. I then divide it by negative 5 to both sides, giving me y by itself, and it's equal to a positive 2. I plugged that y equals 2 into the first equation and simplified, and eventually got x to be a negative 1. I have my x value and my y value together. They come together to have a coordinate point, which is negative 1, comma.